You know this thing? The first smiley face? It makes $500 million a year. So it's 1963 Worcester, Mass. And this freelance artist, Harvey Ball, is on a rescue mission. See, this insurance company, State Mutual Life, has all these depressed cubicle employees. So Ballsy sits down and in 10 minutes, sketches a bright yellow circle, black oval eyes, and a cute little smile. And it's an immediate mainstream hit. The only problem, Ballsy don't trademark it. So a few years later, a crafty Frenchman, Mr. Franken he's pissed his newspaper, Francois, always has sad stories. So above happy stories, he goes, I draw the smiley face, then immediately scoops up a French trademark and goes on a licensing tour. So he prints 10 million smiley stickers and hands them out to all these French free lovers. And they plaster them on bumpers all over the country, which attracts big brands like Mars Candy for Bonitos and also Levi's jeans, but most of all, the Ecstasy Raver. Now today, Lufrani and his son do $500 million a year in sales to big companies like Coke, McDonald's, and Dunkin' Donuts.